feel like I'm losing my mind Is everybody in the world blind? Please, Lord, give me a sign, a sign All right, all right, boy Trigger Man Back in the lab And boy, it's been a while I miss all of you guys, I hope you miss me too Back in the lab, man. Been gone for a couple weeks, vacation. Came back to a whole lot of work. <laughs> Owner of the shop said he was gonna paint while I was gone. That sucker ain't paint nothing. Man, there's so many cars out there. God, I started to go back home and do another week. But yeah, man, Trigger Man back in the lab, man. Miss all you guys interacting, all the comments and just everything, man. Making the videos. So we back to it and first day back, you know what I walk into? The car salesman, auction guy, overall. You know, El Chipo. Yeah, yeah, him, <laughs> that part. Yeah, man, back first day, this is what I got sitting waiting for me. A goddamn overall, overall, El Chipo. And y'all know El Chipo, he like everything cheap. This is the top to it. Hard top convertible, you dig. Y'all know this man, oh, 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 I gotta, I gotta put something on that exhaust pipe. But uh, yeah, y'all know this man, like everything cheap. So what we're doing, we're gonna spray it with the clear that I use on all the jobs here. That's the Amtec, it's Amtec clear. And we got two quarts of base. Um, two quarts of base in our materials, like $120, somewhere in there. And um, the clear, which I post in all the links, it's on Amazon for $190. I think we get it for like 160 somewhere in there. So roughly $300, $280 paint job. As far as the actual materials, the liquid fluid materials, not the tape and the plastic and the sandpaper, just the materials. Cause that's what everybody doing now. So, you know, Trigger Man got to do one of those El Cheapo overall jobs. You know what I'm saying? I wasn't gonna hit y'all with the 99.99. Yeah, I ain't gonna do that. I ain't gonna do that. I work for somebody, so I gotta, I gotta do what I could do. But yeah, man, so I don't even know what kind of damage it had. You know, this car wasn't even here when I left, so I don't know what's up, but I see they did some body work. It's um, good 2K primer, didn't burn through or nothing, so we're not gonna seal it. We're not gonna seal it. We're just gonna put a little base over the primer areas, get that covered first, and then we'll go ahead and, and do the car. You know what I'm saying? Mirrors on, bumpers on, <laughs> even the <laughs> goddamn. <laughs> Hey man, don't, don't, don't shoot that trigger, man. Don't shoot that trigger. I didn't do it. I just came to spray, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> hey, hey, boy, I know they're gonna be trying to get on my ass, boy. But I don't care. All I'm, this is what I'm paid to do, spray. I ain't ready to do none of this, you know what I'm saying? So, all trolls, the trigger troll, I don't wanna hear it, you know what I mean? But yeah, man, so we're gonna get to it. We're gonna get to it. Um, what time is it now, man? What time is it? 10.30. So I'm gonna get, I'm gonna try to get it here based out by lunch. So I go take my lunch, let that base dry up good, let all them solvents get up out of here. So when I put that clear on them, we don't need nothing dying back. You know, we don't need no die back. We don't need no problems with the El Cheapo, man. You know? So, and there's another one out there. It's a, what's that Nissan 350Z? Another, another overall from the same dude, man. Man, used car sales must be going good, but it do, man. Anyway, yeah, man, so those are materials. That's the clear, which I use on all my jobs. You guys see, I have a link for it in the description. It's sold on Amazon, uh, two quarts of base. I'm gonna base this out with my DV1. Uh, I haven't decided what I wanna clear it with. I'm gonna see how I feel. I'm gonna see what the temperature is um, later on. This is what? 81 up in here now, you know what I'm saying? So I'll see by that time, you know? You gotta get the right material, the right activator, the right spray gun for the, for the, for the job, for the temperature, you know what I'm saying? So we'll see what it is by the time I get to it. But let's get to basing this thing out. Again, man, get glad to be back. Miss you guys, man, all you guys in the comments, you know, all you long time people, and I see I even picked up a couple new subscribers. You know, welcome to the channel, man. So I've been gone for a few weeks, month, 
or two. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But I'm Batman. We're in full effect, and we're going we're gonna to keep riding. Anyway, I'm going to go mask up, mix up, and we're going to get to it. Bah! Look who's back. Back again. Trigger's back. What up, what up, YouTube family? Man, look at here, man. I miss y'all, man. And I'm hoping and praying y'all missing the old Trigger Man, too. God damn it. Back in the lab, man. Back in the lab. It's been quite a while. Quite a while. It's like when I took them two weeks off, man. It was hard for me to get back into the groove, man. Hard to get back into the groove. But I got it back. This here is the first job right off of vacation. And the, um, I don't know if I'm going to put this video up first since it's so long. I mean, it's when I got back to work. This was sitting, waiting for me in the booth. So I had to go ahead and knock it out. But I don't know if I want to hit y'all with a long 30-minute uh, video first. So I'll probably throw up a few little smaller jobs before this but this is my first job coming back off of vacation and boy i was missing it i was missing it missing them fumes missing my guns missing all this coverage in the first coat <laughs> i was missing it all man missing it all hey so like i was saying this here actually i got um all the prices for the materials the fluid materials um the clear coat um we pay 180 dollars for it you know as i said it's on amazon it's 193 on amazon but of course we get a little some kind of little shop rate from the supplier that we deal with so 180 on the clear and the base was 90 dollars which is a grand total of 270 dollars wait let me make sure man let me make sure let me make sure Wait, wait, let me make sure, let me make sure. The last time I did some math when I was saying the spray booth is 60 years old, I was off, I was off by a few points. So, Trigger Man getting a little old, so let me make sure. Alexa, what is 180 plus 90? 180 plus 90 is 270. Yeah, 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 so 270, 270. Thank you, babe. Uh, $270. So this is a $270 paint job, according to, huh? The latest trend that's going on on YouTube, you know, and that's excluding your tape and paper and plastic. Other than that, hey man, that's pretty cheap paint job. And this here is for that um, car auction guy. You know, if you guys watch the channel for a while, you know all about that cheap son of a bleep. Yeah, man, El Chipo, not El Chapo. Yeah, so um. Yeah, and that's pretty much it, man. That's what we're doing today. That's what we're doing today. It's going to be pretty lengthy. So if you would, please sit back and grab some popcorn. Grab you some popcorn or bonbons or whatever you like. 14 PSI. Going 14 PSI on my um, second coat here. I got all of that primer uh, covered in the first coat. And the first coat was covered. So I'm just going over it with uh, sort of like a little drop coat second coat to a drop coat and that's gonna be it man you know yeah man we hit it with the one two man we ain't trying to sit in no paint booth all day <laughs> putting on all them light featherweight coats man we can knock it out get it out but um yeah so i basically knocked this out in in less than two quarts because the two quarts i had made a gallon sprayable and i still had plenty of paint left it might have been over a pint a pint left so there was still plenty of paint left um, yeah and with the clear two coats of clear again that Amtec clear I use um, you know I've been spraying with it over 10 years now and none of it's ever come back you know it doesn't come back doesn't fade and die back you'll see this I'll show you guys the next morning clear holds up man I painted jobs that came back years later for other accidents and the clear was looking just like it did when it left. Like, no problem. You know, I don't know what's up with that clear, but it's it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Not sure the warranty they give on it. I'm not sure it was like a five-year warranty or something. But I've painted many, many, many cars here with this clear well over five years. And they come back here and there, and it's still, it's fine. So, 
for the price, I feel like it's decent. And for the price, you know what I'm saying? You really can't, you can't beat it. You can't beat it. Um, you know, it's not like it's a PPG 2021 clear, which is my favorite clear. But, unfortunately, that clear is $750 for a kit. And, um, negative. Y'all know El Cheapo ain't paying for that car auction guy. He definitely ain't paying for that. Trigger Man. Man, what in the hell going on in here, Trigger Man? Man, I've been looking for your goddamn videos for weeks, man. Maybe a month. And you finally come back, and this is what you're doing? Ah, oh, come on, man. You got headlights in the goddamn car. You got... Oh, what, man? Goddamn, Trigger. You got the bumpers on the car. Man. At least you got the goddamn roof off the car. But, man, Trigger. Oh, man. Trigger, man. You know, sometimes I try to... What the hell you doing there? Oh, oh, I seen you do that before. Oh, that's that, what you call that thing again? That's the trigger fly trap. Where you turn the pressure down real low. And keep the dust from flying around. Yeah, that's right. I seen you do that a long time ago when you first started on the channel, trigger. But then I be seeing it elsewhere too, trigger. Can't think copycats. But yeah, man, trigger. Oh, you're using Goldilocks, huh? Yeah, Trigger, man, you even got the damn emblem on the car. Look at there. You got the Porsche symbol on there. Oh, my God, man. All it takes was a little fishing string, man. You pull that off. Man, Trigger. God damn, man, Trigger. Boy, this thing better come out good, Trigger. You got headlights, big old headlights sitting in there. Bumper on. Even the damn mirror. Oh, shit. Oh shit, man. Oh, come on, Trigger. You even got the goddamn mirror on there. How you gonna pull that off? How you gonna get paint under the mirror, man? God damn. Headlight, mirror. I know that ain't no damn door handle I see in there, Trigger. I know that ain't no goddamn door handle, Trigger. Trigger, please don't let that be a door handle I see in that car, man. Oh, Trigger, man. God damn you. Only thing, only one thing you did right in this video, Trigger. And that's you got a goddamn paint suit on, man. Other than that, man, this is all bad. This is all bad, Trigger. This is all bad, bro. This is all bad, man. Who? Man, you're gonna, you're gonna be the laughing stock of YouTube, man. These guys already be laughing at you, man. And talking behind your back and stuff, man. Now you're just making it worse. You're adding fuel to the fire, Trigger. Look at that. Hey, come on, man. Ain't got that mirror, really? I mean, I know it's a car auction guy, but god damn, Trigger. <laughs> that guy, man. I hate to buy, be the guy to buy a car from that guy, man. He's a real shyster. <laughs> Goddamn shyster. Man, he's gonna catch a bullet in his ass he <laughs> selling cars like that, man. Let's see you get under that mirror. How you gonna get clear under there, man? Goddamn trigger, boy. You do that thing like... Look at the door handle. Trigger! Ah! Oh, I hate you, trigger. I hate you. Oh, goddamn trigger, man. Ah! That stuff furiates me, trigger. I swear. Ah! That's a perfectly good Porsche, man. I hate to be the guy to buy a car from this sales person auction guy, man. He seems like a real shady character. But hey, man. On your end, I feel you, man. You gotta, you gotta paint the damn car, man. I, I mean, I get it. I just, you know, I'm like a paint diva. You know, I, I like to see, I like to see it done the professional way. Like the Seta Jet fanboys and you know the way those guys do it, man. But I get it, man. I get it, Trigger. I get it. Look at that door handle, man. Trigger, if I can come through this damn, damn microphone, I punch you in your face and crack the lens on your goddamn face mask. Because that's, look at that, man. 
Even the owner of your shop, man, he must be damn. You know what, man? Just forget it, man. Some things just never change, Trigg. Some things just never gonna change. You know? And it's not your fault. And I apologize if I'm being a little aggressive. But I've waited for over a month to look at one of your videos and you come with this, man. You know? And I'm slightly disappointed, Trigg. Look at all that stuff on the damn bumper still attached. Hey, you still managed to do a decent job. But anyway, Trigger Man. Anyway, Trigger Man. I don't like it. I don't approve of it. And I'm going to give you a thumbs down, Trigger. And also, along with the thumbs down, Trigger. I'm going to unsubscribe. Yeah, so finishing up with this first coat of clear. Um, I'm using the um, Devilbus Pro Light. Um, I have a 1.4 tip in the gun with the TE 20 cap using the TE 20 cap full fan and full fluid and yes I did say full fluid fluid knob is backed all the way back out off the needle you know I'm doing this pretty fast again it was an El Cheapo so I'm not really sitting here trying to get it super flat you know if I really wanted to get it super flat I would have sat Turn in the fluid a little bit, you know, dial it back, a little more atomization, take my time a little slower, but this is the auction guy, man. I don't know how much he paid for this whole paint job, but I know it wasn't much. And again, this is something, you know, for some of you guys, man, who's trying to make a few dollars, you know, you can go ahead and, you know, you ain't got to disassemble the whole car, take it all apart and... Yeah, it would make a little cleaner job, whatever, but hey man, if you're just doing some work on the side and you're just trying to make a few dollars, man, why not, man? Go ahead, you know? Go ahead. You sit there for a whole day, R and I and taking everything apart. Then after you paint it, then you gotta go ahead, spend another day, put it back together. And I'm not talking down on that. That is the way to do it. That's the way I've always worked. But, you know, this job here on certain certain jobs, this is what they do. So, you learn to go with it, man. Go with the flow. I mean, it all works, man. And again, for the price, you'll see the finish when this is done. Like, for the price... And for not taking it apart, I mean, it looked damn good, man. Damn good. And the car left the next morning, you know. Had it would have been all taken apart and everything, you would have sat there putting everything back together, the door panels coming apart, putting the mirrors back on, you know. And, um, yeah. So the next morning, this car was gone by 11 o'clock, 11 o'clock in the morning. You know, I got no bake cycle, got no bake, so it just had to sit there. So it sat there overnight. I came in, and um, you'll see I pointed out one little thing, and I wanted to take care of it, and the boss even told me. He was like, nah, just leave that shit. And I'm like, damn, you know. I mean, it wasn't bad. I'm going to point it out in the video at the end. But, um, yeah, so it left, you know. And then we got a whole nother job from the guy. It's a um, Nissan 350Z. Black. Convertible again. Let's say, man, business must be doing good. Business must be going good for used car sales. As long as don't nobody come back and pop a cap in this dude ass. <laughs> you know? But that's how it goes, man. I know these guys, they, get, they buy the cars. You got a small margin to make a few dollars. You know what I'm saying? So... That's what it is, man. That's why I try to buy my car straight from the dealership. None of that little hokey pokey, buy here, pay here. Man. Mm mm. Yeah, I go straight to the dealer. And you know what you're getting. Car certified. Certified pre owned if you're getting pre owned, but getting certified. You go to these guys like this here, man. Only thing certified is maybe a certified rebuilt title. <laughs> you dig? 
other than that, man, but it's all good, man. It's all good. I'm sure he makes the cars affordable, you know, for guys that um, can't go out and spend a whole lot of money. And that's what it is, man. You got to work within your budget. You're going to buy a car, you know, you can't go to the dealer and your credit bad. You got to work what you can do. This guy trying to sell a car, hey, you got to do what he can do to make a dollar. So that's what make the world turn, man. So, you know, we all play a part in it. We all play a part. Some far apart, but still apart. But yeah, so finishing up this last coat. And I was thinking about putting a third coat on it. But then I was like, man, nah. Nah. Had it would have been a regular customer that actually tips, you know, I probably would have went ahead and put a third coat. Glassed them up a little bit more, but man, that dude don't tip for nothing. I even joke with him when he come in and drop off the car. Like, hey man, you gonna you gonna make this one look nice for me? And I open up my pocket. Like, you gonna make this look fat for me? Ah ha 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 ha! He laugh. <laughs> yeah, ah ha ha ha! Back to your ass. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey man, that man don't tip you with nothing. A soda, a beer, a slice of pizza. Nada. Hey, and that other job that I said that we have there for him, that other overall, my boss said that he wants to paint that in single stage. So that's actually going to be a, it's KH3, I believe. KH3 is a paint code, and that's going to be in single stage. So I'll be spraying that at the time of this voiceover. This is Friday. I'm going to be spraying that Monday. So that'll be coming up. Not sure if that video will fall in line right after this, but it will be coming. Black single stage. I might get that sucker one coat. I might give him one coat. And on this one here, man, when he came to pick it up, he brought some chick with him. I don't know if it's the secretary or one of the girls to work in the office, like to drive the car back. And boy, look at him. Boy, he let Trigger Man, boy, let Trigger Man roll with her for about a good 30 minutes. That'll be a damn good tip. Oh, nice little senorita. Came and picked up the car with him. Yeah, boy, you ain't got to give me no money. You can pay Trigger in honey. <laughs> give me a good 30 minutes. Yeah. On each job, bring that same little senior. Man, let me stop talking like that for my... I forgot my girl be watching these damn videos sometimes. I'm just playing, babe. I'm just playing. Trigger just playing, babe. Trigger just playing. Yeah, right, Trigger, you playing, huh? Yeah. You play around on your girl, man. Boy, Trigger, you ain't shit, man. You, you know, Trigger, you got to come with a little senorita, and you want a piece, huh? Man, you a freak, Trigger, man. I don't know what kind of what kind of stuff you really be into, Trigger, huh? We just seen you put masks on. You had your mask and stuff on, man. You one of the more freaky, freaky guy, Trigger. Mm. You probably dress up in your Michael Myers mask. <laughs> oh, Trigger. Boy. Anyway, man. Hey, but I see your point, though, Trigger. You know, man, somebody trying to... You know, just make a few dollars, man. Do a little car for a little cheap price. You know, whatever, you know. It's all good, man. In the, the day, the car still looks good, Trigger. You know me, man. I just be busting your balls, man. I just be busting balls. It actually looks pretty good, man. Hopefully, you bring it outside in the light like you do those other jobs, man. We see what it look like outside. But I still disapprove of the way, you know, it's, it's, it's set up and everything. You know, but hey, man, if people gotta do what you gotta do to make a dollar, man. Everything not always gonna be, you know, hunky dory and nice and set up all perfect and stuff, you know. Time, man, you gotta do what you gotta do. Looks good, though, Trick. I like that color, too, man. Why don't you tell us the damn paint code, man? I like that color. Usually, you tell us the paint code. I like that color, man. I might want to put that on my Hummer. Yeah, yeah, I said it. You guys laugh. I got a Hummer H3. Yeah. C 
sitting on some 17 inch wheels all chrome yeah but looking good Trey looking good man I'll catch you in the next one Trey do your thing bro spray on all right all right that's what we're looking like the next morning we got a little cold out here today hey it's that guy <laughs> Yeah, it look all right. Flow that all right. You gonna take it out for a test drive, make sure it's still going? <laughs> yeah, that's what we looking like next day. Out in the, I would say out in the sun, but ain't no damn sun. So, that's what we got going on. Look pretty good, pretty smooth, pretty smooth. That's what we looking like. Ain't too much of no action going on. Nothing crazy, nothing crazy. Hood look nice, hood look nice. What do you say, Stanky Stank? This the only little hiccup I saw. It started to get a little heavy right there. But other than that, that's it. What up, Stanky? Go tell her that. Tell her you'll do that for her. No, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. She's way too young. She could be my daughter for God's sake. Exactly. I'm going to touch that shit. So we're looking good. We're looking good. Let me get anybody. We're looking good. So that's what we got on that. It's a good thing it wasn't today painting that. And it's cold. Man, I don't even know what degrees it is, but it's colder than a mother hugger right here in Pompano Beach. Well, anyway, it's your boy Trigger signing off. Catch y'all in the next one. Boop. Uh, yay, yay. Well, this is what we looking like a couple hours later, man. It's a couple hours after I showed you guys I pulled out the booth. All he did was washed it and sent it on, you know. I didn't even get a chance to buff out that little spot. He just like told the dude, come and get it, man. Dude came with that little senorita. Man, I wish I would have recorded her and put her on the camera, man. Good lord. Y'all boys would have enjoyed that one. But yeah, so that's what it is, man. That's a little $270 paint job. You know, that's what that gets you. $270 worth of paint materials. You know? And that's gonna stay like that for years, man. That ain't no that ain't no dying back. That ain't no nothing, man. No peeling, no flaking, no nothing. You know, that's what it is guaranteed man yeah so that's gonna do it on this one um again there will be a link in the description for the clear in case you guys want to give it a try um i ask that you would please like share subscribe i also ask that you would tell a friend and after doing so if you could please tell his girlfriend peace